what's up <laughs> hey guys what's up it's Brandy Giz and I'm back and I need to get myself together so I'm gonna use some Tatcha on my face I already washed my face brushed my teeth and we're gonna use Tasha on the face and I'm going to do my brows. I, I carried my brow stuff in my purse because sometimes I don't have time in the morning. So I keep my mascara, my lip stuff from Laneige and my eyebrow pencil. I know. Okay, so we need to do our brows. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look I'm gonna I'm gonna look I'm gonna look decent at that finish, I promise. I know I'm looking crazy, but we're gonna do the brows. I need to put on some powder. Let's see, just a little bit. So they won't be so oily. Okay.
looking crazy in the morning. But it is what it is. And I got a prayer right here. Now we're gonna take a little P. Louise and put that on the lid. I be wanting to film, but um, yeah, yeah, I be wanting to film and have every intention, but I be like whatever. I do it tomorrow and I keep putting it off. But I need to just learn how to just turn on the camera and film. Okay, so we have that on the lid. Now we're going to put a little powder so I'm going to get greasy. Use some random brush. to let you guys know it is from tatcha and this is their liquid this is her liquid canvas i use this this is like um it's not a sample it's like maybe it's a sample or it maybe the sample or the measure i think it's either or but you can get a bigger size if you like it it's okay and i knew i wasn't gonna go through a primer that fast because i have a lot of primers that i need to get through soft look that's what's right i'm just gonna place a little bit on the dark areas on my face just to cover it up i noticed that um i noticed that uh truly beauty i have an oil that i've been using i have put in my favorites i noticed that my um dark marks have been lining up with that oil Cause that's the only thing that I really use. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna put some uh, mascara on my lashes because I wanna get them, prep them for my falsies. I hope I make it to Chick-fil-A in time. Hotter. I, I think I used this maybe two or three times. We're going to try this. This is from Fenty Beauty, y'all. And they say you can use it as a foundation. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to get a brush and use it as a foundation. So I'm going to swipe.
see how it works. I should bring y'all like in the middle. What y'all think? This is the before, after. Looks pretty good. I have a frame right here, so don't pay her no attention. I don't know why she here. I know I did lay down one day without washing my face. I had took a nap. Okay, so we're gonna take this concealer. Now this is, now, oh, I wanted to let you guys know that this Fenty Beauty right here, it is shade number 330. Let me show y'all, 330. That's not the shade that I'm in, in the foundation, but I just kinda like winged it, and I think it has like um, golden tones, so I went with that, as opposed to getting the one that matches. And it works. It's working. Okay, and then we have golden. And I just put that like so. And I add a little bit to the top. Just like that. I'm going to take our e.l.f. sponge. This is like my favorite. I'm going to spray it a little bit with um, some Charlotte Tilbury. And I'm going to go in and just blend. So what I like to do, I like to blend it like towards the eye lid or the lower eyelid. And just blend a little bit right like in the middle, not too much. And then I go on the outer and blend the outside so that it'll look, you know, seamless. And then I take it, I go on the inner corner, like on that lid rim and then the outer. So it'll last and I'm blending out the outer so that it'll look, you know, right. So I just take a little bit, not too hard, not too heavy and blend like so so it won't disappear that's the way i do it you could do it however you want i'm just suggesting okay like so let me hurry up Okay, so let's see, what kind of powder should we use? We can use some Benefit, right? Hula bronzer. And this is in caramel. Just bronze it up a little bit. Um, I can't lie. Okay, I am feeling this Fenty, y'all this uh, powder that's basically all you need if you you know if you gotta wear a mask like me all day I mean you could do the liquid but this is even better it's really nice okay so we're gonna take the angle brush just a random Anastasia this is her blush trio in pink passion I purchased this at TJ Maxx it was how much $9.99 you have pool party which looks like this and pink passion I think one is darker than the other yeah one is darker so I just sweep all three and add it to my face like so
That look cute. I want me a new highlighter, but I don't know. I'm gonna use this. What the world? Look at my brush, y'all. It's just. It came right off. It's supposed to look like that. I'm gonna have to glue that. But I'm gonna use this MAC. This is MAC Golden Bronze. I don't know if they still sell this, but this is like bomb because you can put it everywhere. Put it like right there. Give you that sunkiest look. that on top because it's like a loose powder um and then i'm gonna take a brush and do the bronzer again this hula bronzer and i'm gonna go over like my nose okay and a liner I need some. Okay. I don't have my uh, other light. I think I left it downstairs. But we're just going to use this liner. And this is from Rimmel Kisses. And it's in. Oh, the name rubbed off. I think it's like Coffee Bean. Should we do Huda Beauty's, what is this called, wifey? Let's see how this looks. It's cute, but it ain't really saying nothing. We're gonna put this on top. See what this do. Maybe I could put the gold. Let's see how the gold. Looks. Which one should I do? This one or this one? This one look cute though. Let's see. Sometimes when I have nausea, I eat I eat these right here. The ginger candy. You can find this at TJ Maxx. Now I showed y'all this. Let me show y'all real quick. This is from TJ Maxx. It's $2.99. It's the gem and gem. You can find this like on the end cap. When you're standing in line, grab one of these. Keep some in your car, keep some in your purse, keep some at home, keep some at your desk, at work, wherever. These are really good. This is like my third bag. You don't run through them that, that fast, but it just helps. It's not just for nausea, but just something quick. If you are hungry and you need something to throw in your mouth, this is like kettle cooked. It's gluten free. It's real Indonesian ginger. It's non GMOs and it's vegan, fat free, cholesterol free, no trans fat. fat. If you got like a nagging, um, sweet tooth you might want to check that out and it has real ingredients succulent snack a treat for senses and the body with a symphony of spice sweetness and chewy texture even the most demanding cravings will be satisfied this right here is bomb now i think i don't know if i showed y'all i bought one another one is mango they're pretty okay but i like the uh, lemon flavor better this one is mango and it's pretty good too. I think this one is by another brand, but it's still decent.
that. Okay, so I'm gonna spray this. Put a little of this detangler in there, just a little. I like the way it smells. So, I'm going to wear a quick ponytail up to the store. I think I need to go to Walmart, too. Give me a second. Let me put a ponytail in my head. I'm using my husband's brush. use a little bit. Okay, that's good enough, right? So. Hey guys, so I made it. Hey, now I didn't put no uh, mascara on the ends of my lashes, but I made it. Oh gosh, so I had a free coupon or free reward for the 